We don't have any cures for any major cancers. If you have stage four cancer, anything, you're in trouble. But what they were looking for in those days, they were gonna call it a magic bullet. Biological response modifier, they called it. We've got them. It's in food and supplements. It's in herbs and spices. It's in fruits and vegetables. And I would say pretty much everybody's sick. And the reason they're sick is because they're living on a diet that is wrong for human beings. But a lot of people put their life at risk doing high fat, low carb, ketogenic diets. You know, we know we want to pack the body with fiber rich, nutrient rich, naturally low sugar, naturally low chemical added foods. Dairy with any cancer, that's probably the number one feeder of a cancer because dairy has so many different growth factors in it. What is dairy? It's a product to make a baby grow quickly. And if you're trying to grow a cancer, you couldn't do better than to take the human body and, and flood it with molecules that make cell membranes unstable, that disrupt uh, gene stability, that increase hormones, that fan cancer growth. And, uh, and our Western diet seems to be tailor-made for this. And the food molecules wash through your cells and they turn genes on, they turn genes off. They induce enzymes, they shut enzymes down. Every meal changes us on a genetic molecular level. You know, a little bit of cell division is essential. But when it goes uh, completely rogue and unregulated, then you, you step into the world of cancer growth. When I say let your fears make you fierce, it means looking at your fears as an opportunity to grow and thrive. And how can you take your fear and turn it into love. Where I've really transformed a lot since the breast cancer is I've gone back and I attended to that grief and, and worked through it. and. I just feel amazing now. This ease comes when we're not in alignment, when we're out of harmony with our body, mind, and spirit. For me, I, I really believe mine was uh, emotional and psychological. Um, they were emotions that were trapped, trauma that was trapped in my body. In order to heal the body, you need to know what caused the energy blockages that cause the cancer. You know, generally speaking, it's uh, the lifestyle. But to me, it's a lifestyle. And I really love my life now. I never thought I'm 50 years old. Happiness is so important to heal. I try to be positive every day. And I used to lift my hands and say, I'm healing, thank you. The number one toxin in the room is emotional trauma. It's kind of hard to escape life without some form of emotional trauma. Cancer has devastated my life. I'm sure it's affected your life too. Grandparents, fathers, mothers, husbands, wives, aunts, uncles, children, nieces and nephews are all being stolen from our lives. It's cruel and it's sudden. None of us are ready to say goodbye. Cancer took the life of my grandfather nine years ago. It broke my heart to see him suffer and die. He wasn't ready to say goodbye. And I wish he was still with us today. I wish my two children could know their great grandfather. Cancer has made it so this will not happen, not in this life anyway. And this is why I don't want to see others suffer in the same way. The loss of my grandfather's life took me on a journey to save lives. After connecting with hundreds of medical doctors, scientists, researchers, and survivors, I came to some shocking revelations about cancer. I discovered that while diet and lifestyle factors are important for cancer, more often than not, the biggest factor in why people get cancer, or whether they beat it or die from it, actually goes much deeper than that. And that's what we'll be uncovering in this brand new docu-series, The Missing Link. I truly believe my grandfather's death, and even a recent friend of mine who passed away at just 39 years old, could have been prevented had they known this information we now know. Cancer does not have to be a death sentence. Make sure to register today completely free of charge by simply entering your name and email on this page.